Back here in the Bay Area, a giant mosaic of Jesus that's going up at a San Francisco church. It's almost finished, and the size is something you just have to see to believe. Sharon Chin climbed up to the church ceiling to give us a good look. One glimpse of the Jesus mosaic inspired Francis Dutro to sing Christ is Risen. It was just overwhelming. It, it's, it's something that can't be described. I cannot look down, Patrick. No, I would look down. To see for myself, I scaled eight stories, 90 steps in high heels to the ceiling. At the top, the giant 3,400 square foot dome at San Francisco's Holy Trinity Greek Orthodox Church. Its creator, Robert Andrews, says it's the largest mosaic of Jesus' face in the Western Hemisphere. It's a very unusual feeling that you get being surrounded by this huge mosaic. How does it make you feel? Uh, it makes me feel great. This mosaic gives new meaning to the phrase coming face to face with Jesus from the top of his head to his chin alone is 23 feet. There are more than 2 million pieces of mosaic glass here. They're the size of a fingernail. The gold here is even smaller. For months, workers reconstructed the roof. Then a three person crew from Italy spent six weeks cementing in preset foot long squares of tile. First, the face of Jesus, then the halo and seraphim. And as he works, Andrews himself finds communion with God. There's a lot of praying that goes on that everything goes in well, too. And it has. 83 year old Andrews, who's from Massachusetts, has created other mosaics for this church over four decades. He's worked with founding priest Father Anthony, who's passed away, but Andrews pays tribute to him in a four inch ceramic near Jesus' hand. Just so he's here, that's all. Some church members plan to see the mosaic up close. I'm going up. Why? I have to. Why? It's close to God. <laughs> the whole church will see the unveiled work in June. Hopefully they'll be inspired. How do you top this? <laughs> uh, you don't, you really don't. This is, this is really uh, primo. Andrews hopes the congregation will echo amen. Sharon Chin, CBS 5. Really something. The, uh, Andrew says the mosaic costs $1.7 million, paid for by the congregation.